Many Spartan fans are rushing to make travel plans to head to Minneapolis this weekend, but will tickets still be available? Fox 47's Kylie Khan tells us the best way to get them and how you can make sure they're legitimate. There was, have been a lot of communications between yesterday evening and, and today to try to nail everything down. It's been a busy day for staff at MSU. Many fans have been trying to get their hands on tickets to the Final Four game. Tickets are going to be really hard to come by. The university's allotment is rather small, and so for most people, the easiest option for them will be to go to StubHub or another third-party site to be able to look for tickets. MSU stopped taking ticket requests an hour ago, and people who can buy tickets have already been notified. So ticket brokers may be the only way to get into U.S. Bank Stadium. The first thing you want to do is figure out what are the terms of those websites. What kind of protections do those websites give you? The Better Business Bureau says scammers take advantage of times when so many fans are in a rush. Sometimes it's an offer of ticket packages, or maybe they say you won a ticket package to the Final Four. First off, if you didn't enter a lottery, you didn't win it. The BBB also warns about wiring money and using prepaid debit cards. Both of those types of payments are oftentimes signs of a scam. The bottom line is... If they see a deal that's too good to be true, it probably is. Kylie Kahn, Fox 47 News. Those who can't make it to the game, don't worry. There will be plenty of events happening in East Lansing. The MSU Alumni Association has put together a list on its website. There are also events planned for alumni in the Twin Cities area. You can find a list of those on the Alumni Association's website.